I don't know about you guys, but eating healthy is not that easy actually. Um, especially when you work, you have a family, you try to have a life also. Pretty much what I'm saying is that we all lead busy lives and we often never find the time to either cook or um, eat healthy. By experience, I can tell you that the best way and the easiest way to maintain a healthy lifestyle is by planning ahead. What I'm talking about is basically meal prepping. So if you can find one hour or two of your day, you can actually cook a whole week worth of healthy, wholesome meals. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. Welcome back to my channel and for those of you guys who are new to my channel, welcome. Just so you know, my name is Naz and my channel is all about simple living and also natural and healthier alternative for health, beauty and mindsets. So if for you, eating healthy is really important and also only using healthy stuff on your skin and your body, and also if you're all about um, how to have a positive mindset, how to, have, uh, how to trick your brain so that you can be more productive and so on and so forth, then this channel is for you. Please join the family and yeah, without further ado, let's dive in, in the video. So the first meal is basically uh, sweet potato and chicken, uh, chicken breast. So the potato is our starch and uh, the chicken breast is our protein. So we're gonna put the, pro the sweet potato in the oven because it takes the longest to cook. And yeah, so here's how it goes. everything is peeled and washed now we're just gonna cut it in small little sizes So for the oil, you want it to be olive oil extra virgin called cold press. And the reason is vegetable oils, canola oils, most of the oils that we use to cook our food are highly processed. Canola oil, for example, is known for uh, to be uh, produced with a lot of pesticide. So it's actually one of the worst oil to buy. So olive oil. start my meal prep with all the uh, carbs so we just made our uh, sweet potatoes now I'm gonna boil the, the the pasta this one is an amazing brand is from Google uh, quinoa bread it's organic and they only use chia quinoa aramente I mean amarante I don't know if I'm pronouncing that well sorghum and there's no flour and it's non GMO too so I got this one from Costco I'm pretty sure you can find it it's yeah so 
You see, you can eat healthy and you can eat pasta. So I'm gonna boil this. And for the quinoa, there's nothing in here, but this is a brand I also buy from Costco. It's also organic. Quinoa is a really good source of protein and fiber. And this one is gluten-free. I'm not sure if quinoa already have gluten, so I'm not sure why this one is gluten-free, but yeah. So this is the bread we're gonna use. Um, so for quinoa, I'm gonna make two cups. So the rule for quinoa basically is one cup of quinoa equals of two cups of water. So if I want, if I wanna make two cups of quinoa, I'll need basically uh, four cups of water. This only takes 10 to 15 minutes, so I'm just gonna put it on high. So now that all of our carbs are cooking, we're gonna start making the protein. So this week I decided to eat uh, vegan, vegetarian, and um, normal, <laughs> basically. So we're gonna eat chicken this week, so I have three chicken breasts and uh, for one portion for me for my size and uh, and for my weight goal I have to basically this is two portion so here we have one two three four five six portion of protein here we have tofu I'm only gonna use half of the tofu so the tofu will be our vegan uh, meal and this one is paneer I don't know if you guys I don't know if it's zooming zooming zoom hello so so this is paneer I don't know if you guys um, ever tried paneer but it's one of my favorite cheese um, I do not eat like I try my best to stay away from dairy but sometimes I do eat um, this type of cheese. This is highly fermented, so the hormones, so it won't really impact my hormones as much as actual dairy. Um, so I, yeah, so this is our vegetarian meal. So we're gonna start by marinating the chicken. Oh, first of all, for the chicken, I'm just gonna cut it. Um, so I don't like to put it in the oven because I really like when it's because um, I find that the oven makes it really dry uh, so I'm gonna show you how I grill my chicken basically I want to cut it in half so it's easier for me to cook all the way through and faster
pretty much it for today's video guys thank you so much for uh, watching the video and if you enjoyed the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you have any uh, suggestions for future videos you can leave a comment in the section uh, below and again don't forget to feed your mind your body and your soul and take care of yourself guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share this video with with as much people as possible and yeah until we meet again bye